Today we're diving deep into the exhilarating world of discovering your passion for acting. Multiple paths, one life, an endless journey of learning, a becoming. Hi, this is Sigello Mili. Welcome to my expression. Greetings, fellow actors and enthusiasts. My name is Sigela Longhieleni and I am an actress from South Africa. I'd like to welcome you all to the first episode of To Be an Actor. So, first things first, To Be an Actor is going to be a foundational series. Whoever that thinks they may be considering acting as a career path, or whoever that is curious as to how one becomes an actor or maybe just the first steps right one ought to take in order to sort of have a proper head start into their acting career so if that is you please sit down grab a notepad and let's have a conversation today we're diving deep into the exhilarating world of discovering your passion for acting so I'd like to take you guys on a quick journey of how I discovered that acting may just be the thing. I want to take it back to primary school where I found or saw friends gracing magazine catalogs and I thought, okay, okay, that's a thing. How did you get there? And I was like, I also want. And through serendipity and my mother's guidance, I was in an agent by the time I entered high school and it is through this agency after two years of being a part of them I got my first TV audition together with my first TV role right and this also was accompanied by me going to two arts and culture focused high schools don't ask me how that happened but when something is meant to be it is meant to be so this meant that I was doing drama at school as a subject. So, with the understanding of drama or acting in a foundational phase, me doing it at school and having gotten this audition and the role, um, I found myself in a space where I was like, okay, okay, this is it. This is, this is really it. I stepped onto that set and truly have never felt more alive, have never felt more sure about doing something for the rest of my life. And needless to say, that is how my light bulb went off and said, we're staying here. There's no other way to go, right? There's nowhere else to go. So I'm wondering whether you have discovered or know that this is exactly what it is for you, acting, that is, is that where you're like, I don't see myself doing it. In fact, I've always dreamed of it. Or your friends have considered you the drama queen or the drama king, or you've really found solace in like production at school or church productions, or really you find yourself drawn to this thing without really knowing what really is going on. So if that is you, I think you are totally in the right space and those emotions or considerations or curiosities are valid and are worth exploring. So let's jump right in because I have crafted five questions so that we can sort of go into this deeper to try and help you find out if this truly be the thing that you want to do or it's just a mere curiosity and you'll just stay watching. Let's not waste more time and go right into our five questions. The first question that we've got for you is, what brings you joy? What makes your spirit really sing, you know, and so what is that thing that gets your heart pumping just a little bit harder? And it doesn't have to be active, right? But it's important that you figure that out and Write it down and explore it and really get to the bottom of it. The second question is you reflecting on your childhood. 
what games or activities did you love doing? What were you drawn to? What was your go-to thing after school? What would you be like, yo, I can't wait to get home so that I can do this, right? That's quite important as well because the things that we get to do or sort of pursue ought to keep that inner child alive. Next question is very tricky, <laughs> but here goes. Third question, imagine, and this is an imagination. Imagine if money was no object and you didn't mind and you were asked to do this thing every day without getting paid for it. What would that be? What would be the thing you wouldn't mind doing daily without getting paid for? Now, this is a tricky question considering the kind of economic state we are in um, and our dreams and ideas of pursuing wealth. But it's so important to know that whatever it is you would be pursuing the wealth for is worth every minute, every ounce of time that you're about to put yourself into. So think about it. And also just a side note with this last question of imagination. It's so important for you to be honest with yourself with this one. Well, all of them really, but more so because acting per se is a journey of on and offs. It's a challenging career path. So it's not always smooth sailing where there's always work. If anything, you're probably out of work more than you are at work. So or job rather, you may be out of job more than you are in a job. Work is always there, you never stop working. So what do you not mind working on every day even if you're not getting paid for it? The fourth question that we have is, where do you feel most alive? Where you can immerse yourself in something <laughs> for hours and end and you look out and you're like, oh my, it's like three hours later and I've been at it without even... And again, we live in a social media age where our attention spans are crazy, but I think if you don't have this thing, I think maybe you should try and dig deeper or explore more to see what your thing is. But where do you feel most alive? And the fifth and final question, and the most important question I believe is since we are here for acting why do you want to be an actor why truly ask yourself that question why because the truth is once you step in it's exactly what's going to keep you going because Things are not always going to be going your way. Challenges will arise. Doubts will arise. Comparison to others will arise. And it's so important that you figure that out now. You're solid in that. And sure, maybe in five years time it may change, but so important for you to define it for yourself right now. Why do I want to be an actor? And that was our final question, as I said, and I'm hoping that you are not only just going to answer those questions on the surface, you are going to dig deeper because it's so important for you to be in a level space, level-headed, knowing exactly what you're entering into and how you are as you enter it, right? And so, so that you don't rob yourself. You want a full experience in your pursuits, right? And some of us enter spaces without having gone through the necessary prelude if i could say it like that so make sure you take the time and actually do the work um because we're building a solid foundation a foundation that you don't want shaken by just anything and that is the end of our first ever episode of to be an actor i hope that you found yourself some valuable insights in the space and also really, really proper questions to divulge in as you sit there and wonder if this truly is the journey you want to take. You've got a week. 
because we'll see each other next Friday. So make sure that at least every day you've got one thing you answer if you don't have the time. And I want to leave you with this. Acting isn't just a career. It's a lifeline. It's a journey of self-discovery and really truly a vessel for storytelling. It's about giving a voice to the human experience and just a connection with the audience members that you are telling the stories to on a really profound level. So it's going to require so much of you. It's important that you know who you are in that space while you're doing that as well. And we are truly at the end of this episode. Thank you for joining me on this enlightening episode of To Be An Actor. Please don't forget to subscribe, to like, to share, and truly comment. Whatever you went through when you were listening to this, or whatever questions arose when you listened to this, and comments, wisdom, share whatever you want to share so that we can have an ongoing conversation with each other. Another thing you must know that whatever questions you have for us, we are planning on answering them maybe on one episode at the end of the series, considering that this is a foundational series and some questions may not necessarily be aligned with the episodes that are coming up. But until next time, stay curious, stay inspired, stay on your ground. And remember, the power to transform lives lies within your action. Bye, guys. In the next episode, we will be talking all things taking the first steps. So let's see how you are going to discover what it takes to launch your acting career.